Ooh, what's up guys and welcome everybody of course me this calendar and today we're using a very very interesting team and a team I really want to use for quite some time and we're gonna call this team Pan Smash basically and it's it's a trick room team with um, a few things in mind <coughs> mm, that's gonna make a great recording uh, so we're using the NG as a trick room setter, basically as an anti-lead, if anything, or a pretty decent lead in general. Uh, Chronon to utilize itself in, the, of course, the um, trick room environment. So is Reuniclus. I could space or switch that out for um, Cresselia, but I want to use Reuniclus instead. And basically, if it works, it works. And if it doesn't, it doesn't. And I obviously have to switch that out. Uh, Paragon 2 with Try Attack Toxic, I had Shadow Ball. But Toxic covers a lot of things that Porygon does well, since I don't have an investment in Special Attack. But we'll just have to see. Uh, and Specs, Hoopa, um, with um, a lot of investment in Special Attack, of course. And um, I think I rather want to give it some Special Defense, actually. So, yeah, I think that's the better. Because that's the environment it's facing. So, yeah, I'm going to go for that. I'd rather have that, <laughs> to be honest. It, it hits like a truck, and so does the main star, Pangoro, uh, which is the reason we call this team Pan, Pan Smash, basically. Uh, and yeah, basically, it is a really, really aggressive set with a lot of HP, and uh, it's only here to be a banded superpowers all over the place. It's really good, it works really well, and um, I really want Pangoro to work in this kind of environment. So I got a huge help from both Ellis and Rob who are two Twitter followers and great battlers. So they're always great of rolling ideas. If you try to make a team work, they are probably the people you want to ask in case you're missing out on something. And they obviously wanted um, <laughs> Chris Alien instead of Reuniclist, but I tried to... I, I really want the defensive presence instead, even though I do believe that Hoopa kind of solves that for me. So anyway, we have tried, I have tried to see him a few times uh, with mixed results, and uh, we are right now in below 1,000. So it's very likely that we're meeting people that are using weird sets um, and using general bad players, but are using a pretty bad team, so hopefully that evens itself out. Or at least that's the point. And if you wonder why there's no music, it's because I just want to see if um, the stream is lagging less with that in mind. And we are seeing a Jardos and Heracross and Shendelo and Vlogius and another Porygon 2 and Reuniclus. So this team is not looking that pleasant from the get-go. <coughs> I need to cough again. Um, though I do see his team with a few hiccups, but um, yeah, I mean, lock myself into side shock with my hoop. I should help a whole lot. Uh, only his reuniclass takes that well. Actually, Shadow Ball would be real nice to lock myself into if it wasn't for the Porygon 2. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna start with the energy. We really need to make those aggressive plays. And I'm guessing it's going to start off with either Chandelure or... Actually, I have no idea what he would lead with. Don't go for the easy. Alright, so he start with Reuniclus. So Reuniclus is naturally slower. Um, depending on the set. But I'm just going to go for rocks. Uh, the fuck? Uh, flash cannon. He has flash cannon on. There. Ah. All right. Uh, why? Why would you have that? Um, all right, I'm gonna go to crawl <laughs> All right, call mines. So that's okay. We're just gonna lock ourselves in, or not lock ourselves in. We're gonna go for a knockoff. Uh, we should still be faster, so I have no idea why we do that, though I do believe Heracross comes in here. Actually, Flodius. Uh, ooh, and it does not take that well. It does not take that well. Um, I'm just going to finish that off. Um, that was a weird switch in. I'm definitely going for Heracross there. So, right, here's the thing. If I were him, I'll go for a sub here. So, I can't switch out. Oh, Dragon Dance, nice. Nice. Oh! What was that? 
What was that? Piss out my ass. Piss out my ass. That is exactly what we wanted. That was a pretty pretty bad play from the opponent though. Um He should have just gone for the kill. Um Wow. That was terrible. Right, let's do this again. One more time. At least two battles. That was a quick one. That team should have done a lot better to, against me, though. Um, Alright, guess the lead. Cobalion is like... It either is Aesop or Cobalion. And I do believe Aesop could go for Taunt as if it was lead. Uh, 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 uh. Actually, Pangoro does fear here as a potential lead, actually. It kind of does. Uh, it doesn't like the potential close cut. Actually, let's go for Danish anyway. Um, Alright, so Aesop was the lead, so that's unfortunate. I can only hope he goes for rocks. But he's probably gonna go for a taunt. Why would you leave with that? Take this. I'll go for Moonblast. Actually, I'm gonna go for Trick Room anyway. Who cares? I mean, if it does go for the obvious play, then, you know, so be it. Oh, just make up your mind. Like I said, Taunt would be a fair play. That would be a, probably a pretty good play from his side, to be honest. I'm actually not too... I'm, I'm not too well used with um, Dianchi, I should be honest to say that. Uh, I really want to try it out as an RU, so that's definitely going to be a bigger thing. Um, but it's working well. It takes hits, it, a lot of good hits. Like, it does take that well, which is something I do appreciate. Uh, dude, really, I, I probably have to start a timer on you. Kind of wanted to avoid that, but I've been waiting, like, what is that, 40 seconds now? Come on. Do something! <laughs> well, you know, we can just win by winning it out, but can't, I don't want to stop the recording either. Um, I think that's kind of boring. Right, so it goes for rocks, which is okay. Uh, now the trick room is up. <clears throat> Let's see. Haven't lost too many frames. But if you guys see her lagging from time and time again, I'm, I'm sorry about that. Um, here's the thing. You don't have Dazzling Gleam. <laughs> I already decided. Alright, uh, Tox? What? Okay. Alright. Um, so he's gonna prepare for the knockoff, and I'm gonna prepare for the Cabalion. Or you stay in? That actually works in my favor a little bit, but I'm not in the best position. I'll give you that. I was expecting something else. Or rather, I was expecting something. Because <laughs> <coughs> now I'm probably in the area where his Chronon can kind of finish me off. Go to the... Ooh. Oh, oh, that's um, I ain't right. That's that's not that that's not how you play. Ah, all right. I probably forgot about mold breaker. All right. <laughs> Tough play. But, yeah, I mean, he still got, like, if Cronon has Awkward yet, then he kind of settles it. It goes for Bandit. No. I'm not able to hurt it that much, so I'm just going to go to Paragon. Since my trick room is pretty much over, I could go for potential knockoff, but 
Um, I really, really, really don't like that idea, since I do believe it can probably take me out. So, uh, let's see what it does. Um, foul play. All right, so that's that's helpful. Um, now, what would I switch into this? I would definitely bring in Cobalt in here, so we're gonna go for Trick Room. Huh? Oh, 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 not bad. So he's badly poisoned, and uh, yeah, foul play is not gonna. It's not gonna work. Hmm. But foul play does take my Pangor out, I believe, even though it's four times resisted. Um, I think. Now, if I had to do the correct guess here, he probably needs to go for Cabalion or Chestnut. And Burn is not that dangerous. Ish. Uh, if, if only he didn't have Chronaunt. I would just bring in Hoop, unlock myself in Side Shock, and pretty much win. But due to Chronaunt, I can't do that. <laughs> Which sucks. A lot. Oh, come on, make up your mind. If I were him, I'd switch into Cobalion here. And that would be a fair play, I believe. It would work in his favor. And there is not a whole lot I can do there against him. And he got the rocks on my, on my side, so my focus sash is redundant on the MG. Also, and I don't have any hazard removal whatsoever. <sighs> That's gonna be annoying. Alright, so yes. I think it's soon to have 60 seconds left. Yeah. Dude. Do you even play Pokemon? <laughs> I'm not gonna be that douchey, but really, he's... I have already considered his options, and they're all good ones. Me staying in for recovery is pretty obvious. Um, so he does stay in. Well, Alright. Here's the thing. Here is the thing. Can't go for Hoopa, for Hoopa gets destroyed by that switching. I can't go to Reuniclus because Reuniclus gets destroyed by that switching. I could potentially, to speed things up, go for Dianchi. Um. Like I said, just to speed things up. Um, Alright, I'm gonna go for a Moonblast here, I believe. He goes for Shadow Snake, which is okay. Um, and now a Trick Room should be over, uh, which means I'm gonna go for another one. And this Shadow Snake is not in the area of taking me out, which he probably saw there. So I'm gonna go for Trick Room. Uh, hoping for Shadow Sneak. His next mod's gonna come in. I'm gonna go for Explosion. As long as it isn't Crawland, I should be fine. That's the thought process. And um, I still have no idea which Pokemon I should bring in. <laughs> uh, Reuniclus might be the smarter option in the long run. Come on already. We have done this before. Huh. I'm like, I'm like, yeah, you you, you do whatever, man. <laughs> we can wait for a little more if you want to, but I don't see the point. But alright. So far this team has does have done fairly though. I've not gone up against like the meta, meta, meta. But I did lose, um, you guys have not seen it, of course, but uh, uh, when I started off, I actually, oh, 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 you're, oh, that's, um, that's too bad. Uh, all right, um, <laughs> goes for Crodont, which would lead me to believe that it has Aqua Jet, but I'm going to do it anyway. Come on, SD, 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 or knockoff. Or crab hammer. But if that's awkward yet, then so be it, basically. Um, 
Like I said, I did lose to a Toxic Croak uh, with Bullet Punch, which I did not expect. Um, that was one of the worst games ever, so I'm glad I did not. I actually lost that 1 0, but I did very poorly. Uh, so even though the scores went on, the opponent I was up against had really no issue against me, so... So let's, let's just say that I was glad that I didn't record that battle. Um, really, this guy is waiting so long. I mean, you either have Orchid yet or you don't. Just do it. I don't want to claim victory like this. Come on. I actually want to... I want to win this battle legitimately is not the right word. Alright. There we go. That's... That's incredibly boring. But right, that's the first session, guys. I really hope you enjoy this one. Um... I do hope for uploading more of these, and uh, I'm just gonna see how the first is doing, of course. But uh, there's the Pan Smash team, and it was very little smashing from uh, Pangoro this time, but I'm sure we're gonna see more of that. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next.